So in this problem, we're told to express the limit as a definite integral on the given interval. We're told the limit as n approaches infinity, this function here, cosine of x sub i, or x sub i, go to x, 2 pi to 4 pi. So in order to solve this problem and write it as a definite integral, you got to know this formula right here. So the definite integral from a to b, f of x dx, of this limit here, um, sigma f of x sub i times delta x. So basically what you need to recognize here is that, so this is the same thing as this here, right? And then, so this is going to be our function. So basically f sub i, f of x sub i, equal to the cosine of x sub i over x sub i, right? And so basically it's just this function replaced with x sub i. So this is f of x, right? So it's going to be equal to this, but the only thing is that they're replacing our x's with x sub i. So if we want to go backwards, we just got to replace the x sub i with x's. That's exactly what we should do. So f of x is going to be equal to the cosine. And we see we have an x sub i here, so we're just going to replace it with x over. Then we have x sub i here, replace it with another x. And then so yeah, this is what it's going to be. And then we just plug it back in. And you already see they have this part done. So they already have the definite integral or the integral sign from 2 pi to 4 pi. So we're just going to plug this in there. So it would just be the cosine of x over x. So this is going to be the answer to this problem.